that's unusual. He's drunk more of his tea than I have of mine, and it's not even gone cold yet. Well, we have a little plan here today, and that is to put the fuel tank back on Peter Torville. That's an unusual tongue you've got. It is, isn't it? The black one. So what are you going to do with that? So this relay is um, an additional relay tool for when you put your key in the ignition, this will switch the, me the main relay and then you'll get power. Okay, so we'll need to move the stuff out of the way, get the ramps out, move Christine and get James. James, the Karate Freelander. The smoker. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. Who's this dodgy guy loitering around your locker? Back into James, which is a well, dream a car for thinking? somebody. Well, we start today. She's going to splutter. Mine gear. Don't you dare call yeah. me an influencer. <laughs> Don't you? Are you offended at that? <laughs> We're about to discover a couple of problems, like this. Land Rover, front wheel drive only. Not good enough. It simply hey. will not grip. i tell you what, do that again, I'll push it. Ready? But never underestimate the power of a mustard man. I push this car up the ramp, whilst the Land Rover struggled to get Stop. a grip. <laughs> <laughs> who'd have thought that'd be the oh that's how you do it big dog who'd have thought that'd have been the solution <laughs> looks like you're wearing a dress to me yeah, yeah. that means that means essentially i pushed the car up the ramps and the freelander helped <laughs> rather than the other way around right he doesn't believe it, but I have video proof. That was a classic, that was. Oh yeah, what you're hiding. Yeah. Yeah, 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 I see you now, I see you. What a display of legs and men with dirty hands. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Proper men like to have dirty fingers. <laughs> Whilst Carl and Tom both have a lovely time underneath the back of that Rover 25, I'm up at the other end having a ponder. You see, I've just had a, a little um, complaint from the landlord about the cars here again. Not so much of a complaint, but the skipman has complained that he can't get in and out very easily because of the cars. <laughs> you might look at this space and think, well, how big a space does the skip man need? Because the lorry is only a bit longer than the skip. Well, actually it's down to which skip man. One of them is very friendly and I talk to him and I ask him if anything's in his way and he goes, oh no, I can get around that. And then there's another one and now there's another two that seem to be, you know, a bit grumpy. The other two can't get through the gate. Then what interrupted my lack of activity was my nephew coming round with a car for me to review. Yep, a car for me to review. That'll be happening tomorrow, possibly. And then my brother came round talking about a car for me to review. Yep, that could be happening tomorrow. I know what I'm doing. That's the fuel tank on and wired up properly. And the best thing is I didn't even help. Are you hungry? Bet you were, aren't you? Marvellous as much as you can do today, that. Clicking top. 
<laughs> right, so what have we got now, Tom? Well, I just wanted to shout, do a big shout out for Steve from Intelligent Fabrications for welding some bits up for me. Yeah, so usually Steve doesn't weld anything automotive. He's just done this because we're friends and, well, if when we get this running, it'll be mostly thanks to Steve for doing the downpipe for me and stuff. You know, stuff I can't do welding. Yeah, I so, know. So we've got, are we going? Yeah. Are we rolling? We've got injector uh, bosses. Oh, on, they've all been welded on, right? All welded on. Yeah. Thanks also to Matt from Australia for buying them and sending them for me. So we can now run a bank of eight injectors, four on the front, four on the back. And we've got two, two MG618 turbo fuel rails welded with AN6 lines either side. Now me, like a, a knob, has accidentally ordered my old steel AN6 instead of stainless, but it'll work the same, won't it? Will it work the same, Carl? I it hope will. so. I hope so, yeah, because it's been a big job of getting that welded on. And job it. Uh, oh, and that's the... This... Oh, that, that is interesting. This is, when we're going for 500 brake horsepower, this is a Toyo Sport naturally aspirated exhaust manifold converted to run externally wastegated and we don't know what turbo we're going to run yet for 500 horsepower and then the flange will get welded on there because the other turbo is only good for what 300 that's so 300 right so there's a lot of work to do yet um i don't i wouldn't say so it'll all come together it's just a lot of man hours isn't it really yeah um man hours man hours muscles and men and we should do it <laughs> engine stuff. <laughs> do that again. What? Do that again. It's just a lot of man hours. No, no, that, that face you just did then. Ah, yeah. Man, man hours. Gotcha. Man. You look, engine. You look oil. Like, yeah. Do man it. make bang. Big <laughs> bang. <laughs> yeah. You look like the scream today. Like what? <laughs> the scream. scream. Oh, because of the beard. Yeah, because yeah, of the beard. <laughs> <laughs> Hello and welcome to Saturday where Tommy Turbo is indeed here and I thought it would be time to write him his own tongue song song Tommy Turbo, 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 Tommy Turbo Supposed to be an all round off road hero, it's fucking shit, yeah. isn't it? I know, it can't pull a small car up a ramp without the help of a bearded man. With his one horsepower, with his one man power. Yeah. Don't even claim that was heroic, sir, because I, I rolled it in second or with the clutch. You weren't pushing that one, was you? Yeah. You no, was I was pushing, pushing this one. one. Yeah, but so how did that get over the, the thing? by my help because it wasn't that could drive up there quite easily by itself but just that bit of extra yeah, push I'll, I'll let you have it I'll yeah you you've it. got to mate you've got to well you haven't got much choice about it because i've already claimed it yeah yeah no worries no worries indeed well that was a nice episode <laughs>